Welcome back to my channel, you guys. How has everybody been? I hope well. I know that it's been going on a month and a half that I haven't uploaded a video. I know, I know, I'm so bad. Worst YouTuber ever. <laughs> I apologize. I have had some content um, in the editing process, but I really, really wanted to get this video up. And every time that I had a day off, I took the day off and did absolutely nothing. So I'm trying to now be more productive and I finally got a chance to sit down and talk to my camera or you guys about all these products. Um, I went to training about two months ago now. Um, for the new company that I work for, which is Boots, which some of you might be familiar and they're not boots as in like cowboy boots or like riding boots. No. It's a, it's a skincare and cosmetics brand that was originally um, based out of like England or the UK. Um, there, It's actually really big over there. Um, it's like a health and beauty store. Um, so they brought a couple brands over here to the United States. Um, and the, the company has beauty advisors and stuff like that, so um, I now work for them. And I, at the training, we received gratis, and since then, I found a lot of amazing products within their line. So I've been meaning to sit down and talk to you guys about them, because this is a lesser known brand, I guess you can say, at least here in the United States. Like I said, they're really big over there in the UK. Um, but like I know how hard it is to like spend your money on stuff that you don't know how it actually works or if it works in general because I know that's how I am and that's why I mean I come to YouTube to go and look at stuff so seeing that I get some of these products for free and seeing that I am exposed to these a lot I wanted to sit down and make a video because you know I never know who's out there looking for product reviews on this specific brand and I have kind of a few or if not a lot of each so why not sit down and film a video on it so that's where I've been here we are today and so let's go ahead and get started all right so starting off with the line that I am most familiar with and that I love and that it has helped my skin as well as my brother's skin which is the botanics range I have quite a couple things from the botanics range this being some of them um so firstly i'm gonna start off with the gratis that i got which is this right here which is the botanics um cleansing foam all right from the all right line and this is just kind of more for all skin types it is a natural exfoliant um but this is not exfoliator if that makes sense. Um, I use this when my skin isn't breaking out, um, just as a good wash. I love it. I love how it smells. I love how this whole line smells. Um, so that is that. Next, I have my Holy Grail. Yes, I love this stuff so much. This is the Mattifying Cleansing Mousse from the Shine Away line. It cleanses, clarifies, and reduces oil. This is a foam that I wash my face with. Um, and this is super, super, super amazing for people that suffer from oily skin and acne prone skin. I don't break out as often, but when I do, this clears it up like magic within two or three days gone and usually if I haven't picked at it with minimal scarring this has helped my brother out tremendously um, my brother has acne prone skin has suffered for ac with acne for several years has tried proactive has tried clean and clear all that good stuff um, he wanted to go for like a more all-natural way um, after using so much chemicals and this has worked wonders on his face let me tell you I he recently came in today and showed me like cuz I haven't seen him um, even though we live together but um, he showed me like his progress and I am just amazed so 
good stuff, good stuff. This is another favorite of mine, also from the Shinaway line. This is what I would say is comparable to Clam Glow, but it's basically just a clay mud mask type of feel, and this is called the Iconic Clay Mask. And I just use this as like a little pamper treatment. I use it with a foundation brush, put it all on my face. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, you know what I'm talking about. So that is that. And this is the Invigorating Face Scrub from the Shine Away line. This is an exfoliator and it has a little bit of the willow bark. The willow bark is what's present in all of the Shine Away lines and what helps with oily and acne prone skin. And all of these were purchased with our own money. Um, my brother bought some of these. And I bought this one because we were out for a while. <laughs> and I'm sorry, Salad Doll. Groggy. As always, I feel like I'm always sick when I make videos. But, um, I am kind of sick. <laughs> Lastly, from the Botanics range, um, we have two of the Shine Away kind of moisturizers. One has SPF in it and is more like a traditional moisturizer and we have the mattifying gel cream um, which is a gel consistency which is the consistency that I prefer and I love and it's really great really mattifies the skin but also leaves it with like a velvety touch um, so these are also great um, but I prefer the gel one so the next line, which is the smallest line that Boots carries, is the Boots Experts line, and I have three products from them. This one I personally haven't used. This is the Expert Sensitive Gentle Refreshing Toner. Um, my brother uses this, and it's just a very um, sensitive, like it says, toner. He he likes it, and he's. Is actually planning to repurchase this tomorrow because he's out. <clears throat> and then I have the Expert Scar Care Serum, and that looks like that. Um, I have that for like old stretch marks and stuff. I am not consistent with it, so I can't tell you if it does or doesn't work. If anyone wants a full on review of that one, I'll stay committed for the review, but I have it thus far. These are also from the Sensitive line, which is <coughs> the majority of the Experts line is made for sensitive skin, um, and it's it's really good. It has very few ingredients in it, so it's not going to agitate the skin. These are the makeup wipes that they carry. There are the Sensitive Cleansing and Toning Wipes. <laughs> absolutely love these they're they don't um irritate my eyes they don't sting my eyes i can take i can like get all up in my eye and it won't burn it won't irritate anything like that which i love because a lot of makeup wipes do that and there's very very few that don't do that to me and the price point on these are great they're four four not four dollars so those are really good so that is the experts line and then moving on to should I move on I'll do the number seven line that is the biggest line that they carry so this is from the number seven beautiful skin line this is a night cream for normal to dry skin I personally haven't used this one I am oily skin this is normal to dry so this is getting passed on to my mother or I don't know most of these um, of the number seven line is anti-aging or it wasn't for my skin type so my lovely family and friends will be receiving these <laughs> but I have heard great stuff from these and the night creams in comparison to the day creams have really interesting textures in a good way next um, one of the really popular items protect and perfect intense day cream another anti-aging that is to help um, deep lines and wrinkles then the Lift and Luminate Day and Night Serum 
um, the it's just for like dark spots and stuff like that and that's a serum that goes under a moisturizer again haven't tried it um, and then I have the Protect and Perfect Intense Advanced Serum, which again goes under a moisturizer and helps with deep lines and wrinkles. So now that that's out of the way, let's see. And lastly, I picked this up. I picked this up. This is the Beautiful Skin Purifying Mask for normal to oily skin. This stuff is freaking amazing. It's um, described as a thermal deep cleansing um, mask to draw out impurities. And that sounds like a generic mask. But when it says thermal, it's been real as fuck. It's, it heats up on skin contact, which is amazing. It's been super, super hot out. So I haven't had the chance to use this recently, but in training I did. And oh my gosh, it was amazing, it was amazing. And it really opens up the pores. <clears throat> So it's another great pamper treatment, um, but I was happy I picked this up. This one is actually sold at Ulta stores. Um, I don't think you can find this at other locations, um, but Ulta does carry this one. So this is the Beautifully Matte Foundation. Um, this is in the color Cool Beige, which is my color, and this is made for oily skin, as mentioned, since it is a matte foundation. And I really have been enjoying this foundation a lot. It is quite full coverage, and if you use too much, it can feel heavy, in all honesty, but I love the coverage of it. And, of course, if you don't use as much, you won't feel that heavy feeling. Let's see. Next, I have two blushes, one in Honey and one in Spice. Spice is like a really loud pink and Honey is more of a muted kind of brown bronzy with pink tones in it as well. Um, my favorite and one that I picked up myself. And then I have this Forest Fruits Eyeshadow Trio. Um, this was given to me in my gratis as well. I'll be passing that on to my mom. Um, because I have so many eyeshadow palettes, in all honesty. Next, I have two of their foundations. One was given to me in my gratis, and one I purchased on my own. The one I got in my gratis was the Lash Impact Intense Volume Control. And can we talk about packaging? Like, sparkle my life away. I love this packaging so much. I call it, like, the little Dorothy slipper. Next, the one I did buy the Stay Perfect Long Lasting Volume in the gold packaging. Again, A++ for packaging, and I just dropped it. But um, what I like about that one is that it has, like, we've all heard of, like, fiber mascaras. Uh, it's kind of the same concept without the two-step process of applying fibers, but what it does is actually elongates your eyelashes by, it has like a tubing mechanism that elongates your lashes and I love using it for my lower lashes because my lower lashes are like super wimpy um, so that is super great at making them super long and all that good stuff like it was natural um, so that's great the last three things I have two of them are lip products this is a lip and shine um, it's like a really pigmented lip gloss that has some tint to it after the lip gloss effect has diminished. Then these are like the chubby sticks that a lot of brands carry now. These are more high shine um, than pigmentation I would say. And lastly I have the Radiant Glow Concealer in number 10. And again, grade A for packaging. They look like the MAC Prep and Prime Pens. Um, and I have a love-hate relationship with this just because it's a great color, but I feel like the, op the op op opacity, oh, how opaque it is, isn't the greatest. Um, it's more of like 
I would say it's more medium to sheer than medium to full and I'm like obsessed with like full coverage concealers and that is my preference 95% of the time another 5% where I, I want to have a lighter day this is when I do love it because it is great and I love the packaging too um, so that is the little roundup of everything I got I believe in my little boots gratis slash all the things that have accumulated since then oh I'm leaving out these two which is just another set of makeup wipes these are the number seven quick thinking wipes um, these are more um, heavy duty than the sensitive ones I would say um, they do leave a slight residue um, and they slightly irritate my eye but again they're more heavy duty um, but I would still prefer these just because they get the job done this just gets the job done maybe in like one less wipe I would say I usually use two to get my face done and that's with like full glam so that's actually pretty good still in my book but yeah that is everything that I currently have and I hope that you guys enjoyed this little kind of product roundup I don't know like little mini reviews and hauls with my gratis and future gratis is when I get stuff um, if you guys enjoy this video I will keep doing it because I know that you know not everybody has a chance to get exposed to these products and I don't know I just love sharing product knowledge with you guys and there are actually some great things in here that um, I enjoy and I mean essentially that's why I make my YouTube to share great products with you guys and you know to keep it real about some of these products as, as well um, but yeah so let me know if you guys have used anything um, that I mentioned or from the boots number seven botanics experts range I would love to hear what your favorites are and yeah thanks for watching you guys I hope you guys enjoyed